Right, well, kia ora koutou. Uh, my name's Mick Simmons. I'm chair of Te Haora o Mohua Trust, and uh, we own this building on behalf of the community. It was probably the um, biggest community building project in Golden Bay for probably 50 years, I would think. And it was a huge community effort, and it was to ensure the continuity of health services in Golden Bay, there were real challenges in attracting health professionals to the bay and the rest home and the medical centre and the existing hospital on which this facility is based on. The sort of the brief that we gave to the architects was to try and make something that was as um, passively energy conscious as they could make it so there's a, a lot of natural ventilation, natural light, natural heating and even though a wood chip boiler was a much more expensive initial capital cost we did have to look at the, the long term view and, and also just to reflect what we felt were the sort of concerns of our community about reducing emissions. We did have to look to the future. I mean, we, you know, we're not going to do a building on this scale um, ever again. I would imagine we might add a few bits to it, but um, we wanted to make sure that it was sustainable into the future. And you could see the, the writing was on the wall for coal-fired heating, but uh, all the trustees were agreed that this was the way to go forward. Well, Golden Bay is a, a pretty environmentally conscious community, and it, it was in the back of our mind that this would reflect poorly on our community if we had a, you know, a coal-belching chimney stack here. And it's, it's actually quite lovely to see this sort of little wisp of white smoke that disappears, and... Um, you know, minimal ash that comes out at the end of it. It's just fantastic. I mean, we've got, what, five, six years of ash in a little yeah. pile out there. <laughs> Whereas if there'd been coal slag, there'd be mountains of it. So, you know, that's a, a consideration too. And, um, you know, also the transport that's involved in bringing stuff over. It's lovely to have a, um, you know, a, a fuel source that is, um, Know, relatively local but um, it's pretty clear that coal is going to be you know priced off the market in the next 10 years I would say so we are very fortunate that we um, we took this decision when we did because um, it's going to be it would be very expensive to actually have to replace the boiler system yeah I'm Anja van Holten and I'm the facility services leader here at Golden Bay Community Health so we provide the services, um, so I work for Nelson Bay's Primary Health and um, we're an integrated centre, so that means we have a rest home, we've got a medical centre, we've got hospital level care, we've got district nurses, we've got maternity, well child, um, so there's quite a lot. Well, I'm really happy that the Te Aora Moa Trust decided to go with wood chip because we're here about health and assisting people to stay healthy and a big part of that is the environment so I think their choice uh, of wood chip uh, is important for the environment so we've always found that if we need a load of wood chip it's just a matter of giving them a ring and um, yeah, the next day or whenever we need it, they will supply it. So that has always been really good. And the drivers have always been very helpful and friendly. We've had a good working relationship. There were some things to work out, but uh, I think uh, we've done that well. So we've worked the things out that needed to be worked out. And um, that, I believe, uh, has strengthened our relationship. We were invited by Esra to go and visit their site. And that was really nice to have a look at uh, uh, how things were working at their end. Yeah, so I'm very positive. Overall, we're doing really well now, I think. Yeah.